part two to this video. It is potentially spray paint day. We're gonna sort of grind back this area apparently and have a look at it, but obviously it is a very thin piece and he seems to believe it's only surface rust from the photos I've sent him, but obviously when he sees it in person, uh, we'll see what he says. But obviously we're looking at getting this rear quarter uh, resprayed today because we've got a few signs of rust going on the arch as well. So looking at getting that sorted um, before it gets too bad. So we've got to re remove the jacks the jacks and the axle stands and get the wheel back on get up there and see see what he thinks we're kitting out just in case other things need to happen i put this sort of cap area back on just to keep it reasonably tight let's go and see phil don't know how much filming i'm gonna do i'm always nervous when i go and see friends but uh, yeah we'll see how we get on uh, obviously there's always shit you don't want to see That every second it's getting thinner. <laughs> it's just a stupid design, Jordan. It is a sh yeah. <laughs> better or worse than you expected? What? Better or worse than you expected or somewhere in the middle? Oh, that's not too bad. Better. Better, better yeah. It looks better than me. I was a bit worried about that middle piece just flopping out. I think for the outside, we're all good. Oh, well, that looks good. I'm very happy with that. I was so. Especially when one turned it into two and then two were getting all bubbly and I was like, yeah, that's fine. It's almost like an infection though, isn't it? It just seems to... Because that bit there was only where the bumper flicked off the paint. So I, so I, yeah, I was hoping that bit wouldn't be too bad, but it just depends how the rest of the rolled this is. It's probably a really easy way to remove that fuel for now, though. Because feels... Had the time of his life. <laughs> Me's want one of these. Oh. How far am I going? Stop there. Yeah. Yes. So, double bubble fix. A little bit of rust fix from the back bumper. I'm, at, I'm very pleased, I was stressing like fuck. I'll keep doing it if you don't think I'll show you the job. It is all good fun when you're with someone that knows what they're doing, but when you're watching YouTube videos going, oh, I'll just blend it in. Oh, yeah. <laughs> just, blend just blend it in, hold it at this exact point of ways to minimise orange peel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Just to give some context, he's trying to make my my rolled arch actually smooth. See, so do I. So, yeah, so do I. But I don't think. Yeah, I, don't like, think I, I haven't given it up that long. No. Like, I sort of. I was playing for the sake of playing, really. So there's no point in doing it. But just one of those things. This is like fifteen hundred, basically. So yeah, just yeah. Perhaps a pan off the paint. Missed you spraying your degreaser. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's good, mate. Protect all the shiny bits. Right, Don't breathe. That's 
just normal sat in black. Just oh, okay. It's a, it's a guide code model. Yeah. So satisfying. When do you want to do the rest of the car? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I've got to keep it up five years. So you'll be in. When you pay for that, yeah. that yellow pearl share. Oh yeah, liquid yellow. Liquid oh, what, what colour? It'll happen. And I'll paint a liquid yellow, and what then you'll colour? just have a track car. Around. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's what the black gold's like, isn't it? Just need a two six seven. Nothing too fancy. Hello. Yeah. I would like to oh, no, I would like to take some money home. <laughs> I'd like to have some money to pay for a pint at the end of the week. Yeah, yeah. One bottle. Only buy one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm nearly there. It's gonna be close. But that's it, so you put that's the greaser. Yeah. That brass. <laughs> Put it in the oven. Not sure it's that type of degree, sir. I don't think you want to eat it though. <laughs> a little bit of prime, a little heat gun. What paint's that one? That's like that rough stuff. Stone shit. Pardon? Stone shit. Stone shit. Stone shit. Where'd you get that from? I might try and clean up the another. Just you, Paul. Number 10, guard you. Right. That's all. Let's try again. Is it quite a light first coat? Yeah. Wow. Whoa. Loads of shit just went out of there. Alright, still good. Huh? It's black. It is black. <laughs> Why did they say worry? No, I don't know. It, it's just a bit of a stressful point now, isn't it? You, you've done so much prepping. You've done so much sort of, yeah. It's easy bit. Well, yeah, yeah well, I suppose it is, but <laughs> when I've sort of been here, you've watched you do all the prep and get it already, and then you get to this point, you're like, please, Lord. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah. Now I've got to, now I've got to get close. It's a lot closer than I thought. What do you mean? Like, you you're, like, like the actual gun and the movement that you do, is that? Yeah. It's like, they say it's the shaka bar. Right. Look how black it all is. Back to black. Oh, Fucking hell, it's like ultra mode. Speed! <laughs> Those wrists you've got, mate. Good wrist action. <laughs> How many coats are that? Two.
Shiny! Shiny! Oh my god! He's a good one, eh? Now I see why you cover everything up. You're a perfectionist, mate, that's why. Fly boy. Time to grease it again. That's something else. Water. No, just water. So I can't smell it. No. <laughs> yeah, it's not that important, you can't smell it. No, exactly. Gold in there, baby. Such a cool colour. What, what's the better now that this part is going to look absolutely insane and I'm just going to want to do the whole car? But now, not going to be mine for much longer, I don't think. So, cool. Just put bumper back on. Mud guard or arch liner wheel. And we're good. We're all done. Hopefully, that video was quite good. Um, yeah, I found it quite good watching all the steps. Um, Obviously there's a lot of prep to it and not a lot of product almost. And, well, I suppose there's a lot of product, but um, not a lot of sort of finishing touch. So it just shows everything's in the, uh, everything's in the sort of build up to the final piece. So it's quite cool to see. Um, and it looks quality. No rust, luckily the bubbles on the arch were only surface rust. Um, on that filler cap, um, the metal is thin anyway. It is obviously a little bit thinner now, but it all, um, well, grinded back on his little, uh, I can't remember what you called it, a Dremel or a die, die Dremel or something. Um, but it all grinded back fine and still had strength to it, so happy with that. I think that was a, a little bit of a win from what I could see uh, on YouTube and everything. It looked, oh, not YouTube, online and everything, and on Facebook, a few people were showing me theirs and they looked horrendous, so uh, quite happy with that. So, definitely got to sort out the car got a side skirt in the middle of here at the moment but proper happy with that shout out to phil what a legend um helping me out but yeah definitely got to clean the rest of the car just who's minging but a mirror and um, obviously got to sort this out um just need some new stainless steel bolts um i'm not quite sure what i'm going to do with this piece yet Mm, need to work it out sooner rather than later. Thanks again for tuning in. This was sort of part two. I hope you enjoyed part one as well. If not, um, I did a video on how to remove all this bit before this bit. Um, but yeah, there was a few bumps and dents and things that he yeah, obviously filled in for us and sorted them out. Because um, they were a bit awkward to get out with the dent removal. So we're all good. Yeah. 
So yeah, he's tried to obviously smooth round my wavy rolled arch from many moons ago, but um, yeah, yeah, I think it looks quite late. Let me know what you think down in the comments, and hope you guys enjoyed the video.